Security and record keeping are important aspects of tax preparation. Backing up tax return data helps protect you against data loss caused by data corruption or hardware failures and can be a valuable tool in your efforts to address IRS record keeping requirements. With that in mind, ATX redesigned features in Backup and Restore for 2013 to help you more efficiently back up taxpayer return data. If you lose data and need to restore it to the system, you can do so as long as your backup data is safe. ATX automatically backs up tax return data, company, payer, preparer, ERO, and billing information. You can change frequency of auto backups in ATX preferences, or change the backup location in our new admin console. We added the admin console this year to help you manage all server-related activities. This can include changing locations for general tax data and database backups. From the admin console, you can also perform a complete backup of the system, restore data to the system from backup, and change your port number information. The admin console also helps ATX technical support troubleshoot file server issues. To access the admin console, click Support. Click About. ATX displays the About dialog box. Click the Admin Console link at the bottom of this window. Notice the two tabs, Server Settings and File Settings. To see where you installed ATX, view the Server Settings. To change file and backup locations, click the File Settings tab. The Admin Console displays two storage locations, File Server, or Data Storage, and Backup Restore Server, or Backup Storage. To change the location of your backup data, type the new path in the Backup Restore Server Storage location. When choosing your backup location, we recommend that you back up to a location other than the primary hard drive in your computer. You can use a secondary hard drive, an external hard drive, or network attached storage. You can also use any cloud backup solution to store copies of your backups off-site. Make the backup location choice that is right for your office. In the event of a loss of data, you can restore the database from the backup data. ATX automatically backs up return data when you close a return or a manager and stores revisions of each return. While you can turn off the automatic backup preference, we recommend that you leave it on, which is the default setting. If you need to restore a return, click Returns. Click Restore Returns. ATX displays the Restore dialog box. Select the checkboxes for the returns you need to restore. ATX lists available versions of the return in the Revision drop-down list. Select the version you want to restore. You can also restore company, payer, preparer, form rates, or hourly rate information. To do so, select the checkboxes at the bottom of the dialog box. Click Restore. ATX may display a message that the return or other data exists. Confirm that you want to replace the existing return. ATX restores the return with the version you selected. If the return you restore has an e-file or bank product, ATX restores that information too. You can view the e-file or bank status in the e-file or bank manager. When you restore a return with an e-file, sync the e-file status with the Electronic Filing Center. This helps make sure the e-file status is the most current. If you want additional tips on Backup and Restore or the Admin Console, see the documentation that accompanies this video or ATX Program Help.